हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टीके फिल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग फाइन फ्रेंड्स वेल फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू रिपेयर वन ऑफ माय यूट्यूब कस्टमर ही सेंड मी दिस कार्टून दिस बॉक्स सो इट हैज केम फ्रॉम तिरुनल विली तिरु तिरुनल विली तमिलनाडु इट्स डिस्ट्रिक्ट इन तमिलनाडु सो इट हैज केम ही इज ऑल्सो माई वन ऑफ माई यूट्यूब कस्टमर मिस्टर संदीप बरिस so well friends this uh, we'll unbox this one and check what is the inside very nice packing this is uh, i think this is dbr सो गए दिस इज यमा डी बी आर फिफ्टीन यमा डी बी आर फिफ्टीन एक्टिव स्पीकर मॉड्यूल ओके गाइज सो सो दिस इज डी बी आर फिफ्टीन एक्टिव स्पीकर पावर स्पीकर वन थाउजेंड वैट फिफ्टीन इंच पावर स्पीकर कनेक्टेड टू दिसन दिस इज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट ब्रांडेड स्पीकर ब्रांडेड स्पीकर पावर स्पीकर मॉड्यूल दिस इज सो We'll check what's the issue in this. Just keep watching my video, guys. This, as you know, this is two-way power speaker, a class D amplifier. Also belong to class D amplifier. This is so. Let's check what's the issue in this. We we'll, we we'll connect the power and check what is the problem in this. So, guys, we'll. Apply power. I put it on already. Okay. So keep some support. So I will put it on. I put it on. So see, see, its power is coming. Two forty volt AC. So. so ac power is coming so we'll check some voltage over here fluctuation is going on so uh, pin number here i must get on 12 this is actually this is c this is the supply pin 12 this pin is coming over here so there is no supply but power is coming See power is coming. Okay, but there is no supply. This is the main uh, IC switching IC, uh, high voltage resonant controller IC. This is a high voltage resonant controller IC. So guys. So there is this is a supply pin number twelve of this IC. This is L. The IC number is L six five nine nine D. This is high voltage resonant control IC. So power on pin number twelve is not considered dropping. It is point two nine. No, it it must supposed to twelve volt fourteen volt something like that. But there is no voltages. See, I am checking everywhere. fluctuation is steep fluctuation is going on so guys now what we will do we will uh, take some uh, ohmic test of ic so we will check some ohmic test on this ic so we will put it off first i put it off so now we will keep on diode range Take this out. Okay, guys. So, guys, we'll check some ohmic test. Check some cold test. So, we'll keep the on a diode range. 
this is the, this is the layout this is okay it's okay it's okay this is mosfet this is in general mosfet so no more shorting see if i check on buzzer range no more shorting no more shorting so this is a diode over here because this is connected to the 10 ohms resistor this is connected to the 10 ohms resistor it's ok Two point two K thirty two K is okay, all these resistors are okay. So we'll check the IC is any shorting the IC. So no shorting. This is seven ohms. It's okay. So this is seventy ohms. This is pin number twelve. Twelve is showing seventy ohms. Actually, this must not show. Actually, this must not supposed to show. I should get here more than kilo ohms. See, there is no any other pin shorted. Four, five, seven. Pin number seven is showing eight ohm because when resistor is connected to the ground. Okay, here this is pin number nine. Ten is the ground. Okay, and pin number two is supply pin. Actually, it is showing seventy ohms. It should not supposed to show seventy ohms. It must supposed to show more than kilo ohms. More than kilo ohms, like that. You see. So it means that our IC is defective. So guys, we'll start removing this IC because this IC is defective. Because uh, pin number two is supply pin, so it is shorted to the ground. So we'll remove this IC. See, now not showing. I told you, it's in showing kilo ohms. See, 26 mega ohms. Before it was showing 70 ohms because of the IC shorted. If you check now, if you check IC, please see. See, 78 ohms. So our IC was defective. That's why. So guys, now we'll replace this IC with the new one. This is the faulty. This is the new one. Same IC. L. The same IC. L six five nine nine D. L six five nine nine D. As I said earlier, this is a high voltage resonant controller IC. Okay guys, so this is the new IC. 
so we will fix that one See the perfectly sold it. This is like this should be. Okay. So now so guys just want to confirm it before it was showing pin number 1270 ohms. So now we'll check. So I kept in diode range pin number 412 is the supply pin remember see like this see it's showing in mega ohms so before this pin was showing 70 ohms so our ic was shorted this ic was shorted supply pin was shorted so we have replaced this uh, high voltage resonant controller ic with the new one so now we'll put it on and check what is the status so guys we'll put it on now check what is the status we'll put it on here's the power switch so it's off i will put it on now so i'll put it on put it on see guys power is done so power has come see so if we give input signal then input signal will also come so guys we will give the input signal see signal also coming So it means our system is working fine. See, both is working. Now, I have not connected the speaker line. I have not connected the speakers. That's why there is no sound. But when signal is detecting, it means sound will also come because there is a problem in the power supply section only in this. So we have rectified the power supply area. We have replaced this IC. Okay, guys. Thank you for watching my video. Take care. See you very soon in the next video. Bye.